Thorne, I'm one of Sam's best friends and also was his best man today. Throughout our lives so far, we've traveled, hiked, jumped out of airplanes, and have had incredible adventures together. And now, Sam gets to take on his most exciting, terrifying adventure, marriage. Since the moment Sam met me and told me about it, I knew this would be your fate. You both balance each other out so well. Uh, you are an incredibly kind and genuine soul. You are the type of person that my brother from another always hoped to find. I remember shortly after meeting Sam, asking Ashley what she needed to fix in him because I couldn't find anything. He had a job, he had a great family. He was even thinking about retirement savings for gonna sakes. Her response to me was that she had nothing to fix. And it was at that point in time where I knew that this would either be the shortest relationship or it was going to be forever. I'm glad that you found some of the confidence in the best way. Herbs are spending and still treats you like the treasure that you truly are. Do you have your bow book? Yes. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> I forget it. Do you want to read first? Do you want me to read you first? Too. Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> um, when I sat down to write my vows to you, the first thing that came to mind was what we always tell each other. I love you more. I want to keep making this promise to you each and every day, now and forever. I promise to love you more than the bad days ahead of us. I promise to love you more than any fight we will ever have. I promise to love you more than any distance between us. I promise to love you more than any obstacle that could ever try to come between us. I promise to love you more than more through all the things. I promise to love you more again and again at the start and finish of every single day, no matter the season, no matter the year. I will choose you to struggle and succeed with, to fight and make up with, to love and grow old with. I will always choose you to be by my side. I promise to love you more. Ashley Lynn, as I give you my heart, I promise to keep yours safe from harm. I vow to always hold your hand through life's challenges and celebrate with you in all of life's joys. As we start this new life together, I promise that I will be by your side through every door that we go through. <clears throat> from our first date, I knew that you were special. The type of special that makes me want to give you the best version of myself. I promise to you my faith, my support, and my undying love. I vow to always fight for us because together I know we can overcome anything. You're my love, my best friend, my home, and my punky. I take you as you are now, tomorrow, and for any eternity to become my wife. We're gathered together in the sight of God to celebrate together with you one of life's greatest moments, to give recognition to the worth and beauty of love, and to bless the words which shall unite the two of you in all of that world. I want the both of you to be happy and hopeful. Let optimism be a constant, because today you will make a difference. Time is precious. Refuse to allow what little time you have to be filled with self-pity, anxiety, or boredom. Face every day with the joy of a child and the courage of a giant. Today, you will make a difference. Remember that it is okay to stumble, but remember to get up again. Because today, you will make a difference. You both make a difference in many lives. Remember to spend time with those that you love. Start each day by hugging, thinking and listening, because today you are making a difference. Run your race. Nothing good happens when you compare and contrast. You be you. Enjoy life. Do not occupy yourself with another person's talents. Stay focused on your own. Turn a deaf ear to doubters. Ignore the naysayers. 
People have the right to say what they want, but you have the right to ignore them. Don't waste your time worrying about what the future holds. We have today, in this moment, so enjoy it and make a difference. My advice as a mother to both Sam and Ashley is to trust the Lord to lead, guide, and protect you. We love you both. Congratulations and welcome to the family. She was brought in this world, she changed my life for the better. Things were no longer about me, but about this beautiful little girl. I remember the first time she called me dad, a feeling no dad ever forgets. No. <laughs> oh, you look beautiful. I love you. It was then that I realized she had me wrapped around her little finger. And boy, did she have me wrapped around her finger. Ashley always knew what she wanted, and usually it wasn't cheap. Ashley loves to shop, and the funniest thing is, it doesn't even have to be for her. She loves to spend money. Good luck, Sam. Well, Sam, going forward, you better get used to all that advice you're about to receive from Ashley over the coming years. Just remember, though, she says those things because she cares about you. It's just the motherly nature coming through from taking care of her baby brother. She can't help that instinct she has to care for the people she loves. If there's one thing about Ashley, she wears her heart on her sleeve. So remember, Sam, always be gentle and kind to her. Don't forget, I've got my eye on you. I know you'll take the best of care of Ashley, though. In all honesty, you put up with more shit than I already have. But really, I know you two will be very happy together. And I'm very happy that Ashley met such a great guy like Sam. Cheers, everyone. Sam, in the words of the singer, Forrest Black, let your arms be a place you feel safe in. She's the best thing that you'll ever have. She'll love you and you love her. A toast to Sam and Ashley. I knew when she met Sam, he was the real deal, and it was no surprise that he was what made our family whole. Ashley and Sam had an analogy that depicted a unity puzzle in their ceremony. That analogy is a perfect representation of how Sam is that missing piece that completes our puzzle to our family. Can't express how proud of a father I am that my daughter met an amazing man that I now get to call my son-in-law. Sam, we welcome you into our family with open arms. Daphne and I love both of you more than you'll ever know.